last hour and a half, Atlanta police gave an update on the case. Fox says Tyler Fingert is live at police headquarters with the very latest for us. Tyler. Alex, good afternoon to you. During that news conference, the Atlanta police chief announced that despite the massive $200,000 reward for information leading to the arrest and conviction of people who are causing violence or vandalism or other crimes related to the controversial Atlanta Public Safety Training Center, also referred to as Cop City, those incidents keep popping up. I want to go to some pictures that Atlanta police released today of the most recent case, which happened yesterday in DeKalb County. The agency says this piece of construction equipment was lit on fire. Investigators called the protesters who did this anarchists, but it's not the only recent case. APD says a 23 year old man was arrested in South Carolina for vandalizing construction equipment there. Both of these cases came after officials announced a massive $200,000 reward last month for information leading to the arrest of individuals related to public safety training center violence. Today, they doubled down on that reward. Take a listen. That reward information will appear on over 450 billboards across the country in major American cities that we believe these individuals are coming from when they travel to Atlanta, Georgia to set fires. These billboards will be present in Detroit, Seattle, Nashville, New York, and many other cities where we believe that right now someone is sitting that knows who is setting the fires, who is impacting the safety of Atlanta, Georgia. While there are people who do not want to see the Atlanta Public Safety Training Center built, the Atlanta Police Department says that it is happening and they're going to hold anyone accountable who continues to cause this type of violence and destruction within the city of Atlanta and with their partners. They'll hold people accountable from throughout the country. Uh, they're asking anyone with information to call Crime Stoppers. We have that number on our website, fox5atlanta.com. We are live in downtown Atlanta this afternoon. Tyler Fingert, Fox 5 News. Okay, Tyler Fingert with the latest on the so-called Cop City drama. Thank you.